Well, that was interesting. It for some reason said random file name when I completed the mission and I had to quickly go through it again from the last save. But I just started recording here because there is the next mission button. It's very interesting how I can't seem to have a good start to anything. How did our ancestors anything. get this tooled up? Their weapons are better than ours. They've got to be from the future, same as us. Probably Russians. Like every country has a time machine these days? You got a better explanation? Whoever they are, they want to stop us. And it won't be hard. You want to be more careful. Lieutenant John McMillan, can you tell me what's going on here? Sure. We've got an order to wait and see what happens. That's all the info I've got, and I don't like it. Hold on. They're trying to get through. Alpha base here, listen up. The enemy are based seven miles north of you, and we are beyond them. This just keeps getting better. Shut up and listen, Parker. Survey the area and contact all other survivors. And then what? I warned you, McMillan. Try to capture an outlying Russian building, consolidate your position, and await further orders. It's crazy. If we kill their guys, we've got to wait for their friends to come looking? Let's put a bullet in our brains now. Size of yours, it'd be hard to hit. You heard the colonel. He gave an order. We do what the man says. So, now, now we are in the next level where we have to go take a Russian encampment for our own and then see what happens. Boy, that'll be fun. Also... Ready? Life carries over. I forgot about that. Ready? Now, these two... Here, sir? Ready? Yes? We're going, sir. Yes? Fine, sir. These two are... Yes? Generic characters. Because they yes. actually... They are just there, and we will probably never see them again after this. Because that is the voiceover for generic characters. I think there's actually another variation, but I remember just test recording to see if this worked, or to see if this worked in the next level or if it had stalled wrong or something. That these guy, that these two were completely different. Yes? She had a ponytail and didn't have glasses, Ready? and that guy looked much whiter and had blonde hair. Yes. So, just something. And as you yes. can tell by their different clothing, they're a different class. Specifically the highlighted one, which is the engineer. The engineer are the base building yes. and resource collection classes, er, class, singular. And as you can see, we can build buildings, but we don't actually have the resources to do that. So for now, they're stuck as engineers. Allah be praised. I cannot believe the Eon works. I thought I was going to die. If we hadn't got here, you would have. The Russians are killing our people. Russians? Don't ask me how they got here. But they're good soldiers with a good kid. I owe you my life, Lieutenant. I hope I can repay you. Tell me what you can do, and you can make a start. I am a nuclear physicist. My name is Paul Katam. Great. You were working on the Eon, and you thought it wouldn't work? When you know everything that can go wrong, it takes a lot of courage to get inside. Even scientists need faith now and again. You sure will now. I can see some of you already saw action. I'll have a look at the wound if you remove that filthy rag. Now, Paul is a scientist. Which means, as you can tell by him healing Bobby Brandon, that he heals people. For some reason, the scientists are generally science just you know like doctors and scientists it all goes into one so any science scientist character will be able to heal yes however they cannot heal themselves so that's something you really My need to scientific skill just got better <laughs> that's something you really need to be careful for and it's nice for an infantry squad to have two so the doctors can heal each other and paul is a very weird character as you can tell by his voiceover that he is pertinent to the story by his actual intro being different can do sir and yet Can't his do, sir. orders are of a generic character i'm not sure if that's a glitch or what but <laughs> i thought Fine, that was sir. kind of funny sir 
Now, I just want to say, I'm on it. from, as you can probably gather from them not having M16s with them, or whatever they're using, they don't yes. actually have weapons yes. that are really good. They have I'm here. all characters, all classes who are not... Oh god, there are bodies lying there. All our guys, and all dead. They've been like this a few days. We gotta keep moving, people. Let's go. All characters who are not soldiers, I'm just going to save again, Done, are sir. equipped with a pistol, Finished, sir. which is doc. Even the doctors have a pistol to defend themselves with. It's not particularly good, but it gives Move them it. something. There is their base. Let's get Paul a little bit better. Let's. Lower here, the game speed a bit. Okay. Because this is where the yeah. micromanagement comes in. Because as you can see, the AI is micromanaging right, their characters too. No way we're going through without more firepower. Retreat! Oh, we're going through. All right. Shoot him. In the area, sir. Shoot him dead. Boy, Shoot him dead. Eat this. Time to that kill. is their doctor, so we need to actually be I'm careful. Way, and Move that is a sandbag wall. You have... If it's a sand... If they have a sandbag wall, they take like half the damage they normally would. Ready? On top of the sandbag wall, just protecting them in general. Come on, lady. Get away. Okay. okay. We should be able to kill, or at least make them retreat. Yes. Let's kill him, and then retreat, and allow Paul to do some of his medical expertise. Now, as you saw, they use yes. their pistols, but they now. also kind of die a bit faster. Let's increase the game speed so he does his healing much faster. Which is still pretty slow, even on the maximum speed. And then we will take out the bunker. Ready for more, sir. Yes. Uh, 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 uh. Not so fast, game. Yes. You're not you're not dragging me over there yes, just sir. because I'm having my people get stopped to Here, heal. Here, sir? On it, sir. Uh what's yeah. next, sir? I like how it says we need more firepower, but I don't think there's an Good, actual sir. way to get past that without just going through it. Because if we walk there, I think they'll come after us from that direction. Now let's... He... I think he's more, healed. Yeah, he's healed everybody. So let's yes. get him out of the way. And then get these guys to go shoot Time at the bunker. Kill. He's not on our side. Just Damn. shoot that guy. My shoot him. Just got better. Lower the game speed a little bit, because this is really yes. dangerous. Way, sir. I need help. Oh crap. Ready? Uh, okay, sir. They're Come and heal. Me, sir. You run away. Yes. Shooting at me, sir. No yes, problem, sir. Shoot okay. at the doctor. That Make the hurts. doctor run away. Ah. Yes. Group up. Shoot this. Uh, get Cyrus out of there. Because he is in the yellow. And they're shooting at Paul. Okay. Paul. Not you. Lady. Paul. No, okay, they'll shoot at him. Shoot him dead. I think Paul is going to die. And he did. So let's... Try that again. Yes. As you can tell, even at the start, it's a little bit crazy. And you can tell why the micromanaging comes into play. Now it says, we need more firepower. So let's actually yes, go. Sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> I've done it. Yes. Let's I'm actually go it. around and see what we can do. Sir, yes, sir. Because I have done it at a forward base assault, but it's just as you saw, yes, very sir. micromanagement Moving. intensive, and I don't think I've actually sir. 
ever bother to go around Nick. first. Now, there's something down here. Yes, sir. I think... Ready? I Drop think Paul's... Dead, you Russian bastards. Quickly, we must oh, help. shit. Oh, I'm finished, sir. Hit. That guy yes, got sir. shot down. Time to kill. Hey, Paul, get over here. I'm here. Okay. So what now? Well, we just save save somebody from getting shot, and it looks like we couldn't save someone else. Thanks, Doc. How's Jerry? Somebody's gonna pay for this. I'm done. I'm ready for yes. More, sir. Yes, well. sir. Yes. Nick. Can do, sir. We saved a generic character. I think he was actually someone different yes, the last time I played this. I, Ready? Because I don't think Can he, do, sir. Moving, had, sir. he was Can a do, sir. guy with curly hair, a Moving, mustache, sir. and glasses. I don't recall that being a thing. Sir, yes, sir. So let's yes. now that we've Ready? pretty much healed. And okay, Moving. done here. Yes. Let's walk over here. And that was the sound of something warping in. Moving, sir. We don't know what, Ready? but something Moving. just warped in Fine, sir. somewhere in the world. Nick? Oh, I just remembered. My particular challenge, Done which it. is part of the reason why I restarted. So what now? If okay, someone sir. dies, yes, sir. Ready for more, okay, sir. To rest a while, like, sir. this will be a the best of my abilities, Nick. a no death run. I'm here. Which is to say, we will not lose a single character short of maybe on the last missions, because those are impossibly difficult. Like, Nick. Ready? it Moving. is extremely hard to Ready have more, sir. it so not everybody, not not a single person dies later down the line. There's no way we're going through without more firepower. Retreat! There's nowhere else to go. Shoot him. So, shoot it. Yes, sir. Out. Have you guys come over here? Out. And what we'll do... Lower that. Ready? Have you heal him. And then... Raise it a bit. Jesus, Soon as someone no, goes hurts. into the yellow, support. Support. Over here. I'm on it. Ready? Moving, we will sir. have them walk, step away. My skill just got better. Sir. You go away now. Let me at him. And all that's that left are these hurt. two. Shoot him. Yes. As Paul slowly heals people in the back. And this is how the early game really plays. Let's get John out of there merely because it's hot. Yes, sir. Sir, yes, sir. most people actually need some form of healing. John? John? I moved you back for a reason. Because when that thing gets into the red, Nick. much like people, it becomes unusable. People become unusable when they're in the red. Things do not... Yes. That's one thing, they kind of walk around and idle a bit. But if they see something, they go to start shooting at it. So... Whenever something gets into the red, it becomes unoperable. So if it's people, they'll fall down and slowly bleed out. Buildings will slowly start to burn down. And vehicles will slowly start to burn until they eventually explode. Which, yes, if people are close enough to the vehicle when they explode, they will get hurt. And the engineers will get out of the vehicle and try to repair it when it gets low enough. And sir. if you don't order them sir. away, okay. they're going to die. Yes, you get out of the way. As you can see, okay. as I said, he's out of there. Now, 
I want. I want you. Yes. And you. Yes. To go forward. I want you to stay back. Because I think. Let's actually just save. Because I think we can salvage this. Like we can stop it from burning and then salvage the pieces from Ready? it and generally possibly later I'm down the line you, take it for ourselves it doesn't cost any resources to repair things but it just takes time which in some Ready? cases is a pretty valuable resource yeah. so they will yeah, slowly sir. repair that and yeah, later sir. down the time Later down the line, we can have them dismantle it, which will get partial funding for what it took to take that. I'm on it. Okay, so sir. now that we've healed and we have those guys working on that, let's just save again. So what now? There is another bunker and the rest of Moving, the men sir. that we saw earlier. Yes. Done, sir. Can do this, uh, sir. Stand, stand your ground. Time to kill. Oh, oh yeah. Somebody to kill. That's a bit of a crazy battle right so there. So what now? What I think, possibly, we can go around the I'm back dead. and avoid possibly most of their forces. Wait, what's over here? I think I recall there being something right here. On my way, sir. There no is. My engineering skill just got better. There is actually. Ready? He's not on our side. Quick, into the vehicles. Damn. Oh. Russian tanks. Kill the driver before he gets in. Stop, everybody! Incoming. Time to kill. Come on it. Those were the Russian Time drivers. Oh, well, they're not driving yes, anymore. Sir. So, we've got that repaired, yes, and we killed Move the it. Russian. Drivers of these vehicles. Sir, sir. Apparently, that was the, that was actually Weird vehicles, man. Ain't seen nothing like this before. Check them out, Bobby. They got a beat walking our way through the front line. <laughs> yes. So. Yes. That guy was actually the an, the driver because Next that was day. a specific Russian Lieutenant mechanic. Lieutenant McMillan reporting to Alpha. We're now in command of a Russian installation. Where do we go from here, Colonel? Once we establish your exact location, we'll be on our way. Until then, maintain your position and gather deposited supplies. If you're where we think, then you've one more base in the area. Try to capture it. You want to stop talking to that guy, Lieutenant. He has some really bad ideas. So there is that other base that we were trying to assault that it recommends us to going for. Now... We can build a bunker and we can build an armory. We stole 500 crates. Ooh, wow. I know there's a way to rotate these. And I'll look that up later. But right now, yes? I no problem, don't want to waste time doing that. These crates look useful. I'm here. Now, here's the part of the game that's the resource part. These crates right here which pop up as a little white dot on the map, as you can see, on my way, sir. are my the resources. Free. They randomly warp in, much like that sound we heard earlier, into random points of the map. So Let's they could go. warp on the other side of the map. They could warp over here, and our guys, the, engine the yeah, engineers, would have to go pick it up and take it over to the depot, where all of the resources are being stored. Ready? Now we Ready? can freely yes? make people Fine, go sir. in here and turn into soldiers. As you can Ready? see, the two Ready? engineers now have gun Fine, proper guns, and we can send them back into the depot to have them have Ready? regular stuff. Ready? Now we're going to take yes, yes, the two. I've done it. Yes. most mechanically Ready? inclined people yes, sir. and put them yes. in the vehicles. Ready? 
they cannot actually repair the vehicles because they are not mechanics. So what now? But we cannot actually build the building required for them. Ready? So let's just move these guys up there and hope we didn't block the way for the vehicles to get out. It's looking like no. We didn't. Okay to rest a while, sir? Let's go! So what we can do is no, sir, oh sir. hello Fine, sir. that is a russian what laboratory now? if we capture that which my dad will have to have at least one engineer to go capture it we can freely turn people into scientists and we can house someone to to accompany paul to heal everybody but i think i know what we are going to do which we're going to do a kind of pincer attack where these guys go up front and distract the bulk of the forces and then these guys come in the back and shoot them from there since yes. these are disposable vehicles that were graciously given to us by the russians it should be fine also i like how you can actually see their little heads right there that's kind of funny because you can see that they're a different color <laughs> i never noticed that before actually but I will save that for next time. So when we come back, we will assault the Russian base and hopefully not die too painfully in the process. Until then, see you later.